Elon Musk moving closer to a Twitter takeover. Kelly O'Grady has all the latest details. Good morning, Kelly. Good morning, Dagan. Yes, Elon Musk now officially has the money to buy Twitter. In a new SEC filing, the billionaire revealed he secured a total of $46.5 billion to fund his takeover offer and that he's indeed considering a hostile tender. Now, Musk is putting up $21 billion himself. That's higher than the 10 to $15 billion he was reported to be willing to pour into the offer. The remaining $25.5 billion will be loaned by a group of banks led by Morgan Stanley that includes a $12.5 billion loan pegged to the value of his Tesla shares. Reports are surfacing He's now in talks with private equity firm Toma Bravo to finance some of that, but no agreement yet. Twitter confirmed to Fox Business that it's committed to conducting a, quote, careful, comprehensive and deliberate review. It gave no indication, though, as to when they'll respond. Now, while Musk is prepared to spend billions to protect online free speech, he's fighting strong opposition. Former President Barack Obama doesn't think Silicon Valley is going far enough. In a keynote address to Stanford University yesterday, he implored big tech to ramp up their content moderation. The First Amendment is a check on the power of the state. It doesn't apply to private companies like Facebook or Twitter. With that power comes accountability. And in democracies like ours, at least, the need for some democratic oversight. For years, social media companies have resisted that kind of accountability. Now, Dagan, that begs the question how Elon will even enact change when facing these ideological challenges around moderation. It's no secret the attempt to regulate big tech on everything from Section 230 to data privacy is a bipartisan effort. But first, his bid will need to be accepted, and the ball is now in Twitter's court. Kelly, thank you so much. Have a great day. Kelly O'Grady on Musk and Twitter.